My Fair Lady has all the elements of the perfect musical, as I said in the previous video, but I hate it anyway. This is the second of two segments explaining why. In the first video, I complained that My Fair Lady treats serious subject matters like domestic violence as if they are funny and even charming. In this video, I'll demonstrate that My Fair Lady has no discernible theme. I've found three possibilities that seemed promising, but don't work. What's the theme of the show? Here are three morals of the story that don't work. Lesson number one, the sculptor becomes the sculpted. Some shows involve one character who tries to mold a second and ends up being transformed themselves. Think of Wicked. Because I knew you, I have been changed for good. And Annie, I don't need anything but you. But in this show, Eliza doesn't sculpt Higgins at all. In fact, the professor directly asserts, I can't change my nature. Is that supposed to be ironic? How did she change him? Lesson number two, love can conquer class differences. Think of Hairspray, Aladdin, Aida, South Pacific, shows that emphasize love's ability to conquer class and other differences. But My Fair Lady is not a love story, or if it is, it's a deeply disturbing Stockholm syndrome one. Yes, there's a class difference, but alone, that's not enough to make a theme. Lesson number three, wealth won't make you happy. Remember Fiddler on the Roof? Tevye wished he was a rich man when his older two daughters choose impoverished husbands. And Pippin is about a prince searching for happiness, which he can only find with simple joys of a family. But that theme doesn't work here. It's got a promising start in Eliza's I Want song, fantasizing about comfortable living quarters. Then she gets comfort, and by and large, she becomes happy with the creature comforts. And don't forget her spendthrift father, for whom wealth also brings happiness. So here's a show which is filled with nastiness and which has no significant theme. How is that the perfect musical? Can you think of a theme that works for this show? Put your answer in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Check out my Broadway Maven playlist and press the button to subscribe.